Moss Construction was contracted to build a new 30,000 square foot bank on the same lot as the existing bank. The existing bank had to remain in operation while traffic business to its drive through facility had to shut down. The project began with excavating and pouring of concrete for a full basement. One side of the basement was only three feet from the existing building, while the other side was five feet from the adjoining property. There were high voltage electric lines, underground water mains, and fiber optic cables three feet to the back of the building that had to remain until completion of the project. Steel piling was used to shore walls as there was no room to properly slope dirt banks. The first and second story of the bank was constructed using steel beams with light gauge metal walls. The design called for a pitched roof of light gauge framing, sheathing, and shingles. The interior is drywall with paint and wall coverings. There was also extensive walnut trim, doors, wainscoting, and columns throughout the interior to finish the look. Moss Construction's complete scope of the project including performing all of the concrete, steel, and carpentry work. Local ABC contractors were hired to perform all of the finish work except for the masonry and elevators. The new bank was built within the scheduled time of one year while keeping the existing bank open and protecting all utilities. After construction, the existing bank was demolished. It was a two-story wood frame with brick facade. With only three feet between the buildings, it required careful planning not to damage the new building. After demolition of the existing bank, a new parking lot and entrance to the bank had to be built. This took an additional six months to complete. Whatever the challenges presented, Moss Construction addressed them directly, efficiently, and thoroughly to deliver a major, multi-phase construction project with an extreme degree of difficulty, on time, and under budget.